If you're thinking of taking that extra long shower to cool off, you might want to think twice. Manitoba hydro rates are going up. The province says the increase will bring stability to people impacted by the COVID-19 pandemic while attempting to keep rates among some of the lowest in North America. On Thursday, the province announced they will introduce legislative amendments to Bill 35 this fall that would set interim rates for Manitoba Hydro and limit annual rate increases to 2.5% for 2021, 2022 and 2023. This three year set rate is the lowest rate increase in 10 years and will result in an average increase of $35 per rate payer. Finance Minister Scott Fielding says Manitoba Hydro had previously requested a rate increase of 3.5%. However, the government's decision to increase rates a full percentage point lower had to do with trying to find a balance between the more than $23 billion of debt Manitoba Hydro currently holds while at the same time protecting rate payers. The real reason why rates increased is because of the reckless decisions by the NDP government that cost Manitobans $10 billion and created a massive debt that now has to be repaid. That's Fielding referring to two massive hydro projects and the economic review of Bipole 3 and Kiask. The report cited a lack of NDP oversight during construction on the projects, which led to cost overruns and a large increase in debt. Yeah, well, the PCs always like to uh, blame the NDP for for everything. Uh, but of course, Manitobans can see through that. And uh, it's clear that what they're doing here is they're essentially bypassing the Public Utilities Board. Manitoba hydro critic Adrian Sala says in the past, any hydro rate increases would have needed approval by the Public Utilities Board. However, the PC government is now increasing hydro rates through legislation and are cutting the Public Utilities Board completely out of the process, which he says should be concerning to Manitobans. That's unprecedented uh, in Manitoba. Uh, and as far as we know, this is the first time that a government has actually used this approach to raise hydro rates on Manitobans. So unfortunately, Manitobans will never know whether or not these hydro rates were actually required or not. The new rates will be voted and debated on this fall. If approved, the rate increase will take effect in December of this year. In Winnipeg, Mark Neufeld, City News.